Joe Zekas from Yoshicago.com. I'm in Chatham on 83rd Street with Worley Glover. Howdy, Worley. Hi, Joe. You Hi. were telling me you were looking at uh, Ground Zero for Walmart across the way there. Yes, uh, this intersection will be, uh, be the main intersection in and out of the uh, for, for the Walmart uh, store. And the Walmart store will be on 84th and uh, South Holland Avenue. People are uh, pretty excited about that? Uh, people are pretty excited. They're pretty excited both, both positively and negatively. Uh, we have residents who are for the store and we have residents who are against the store. Is there uh, an even split or what do you It's pretty much an even split at this point. Uh, so uh, it's going to be interesting to see how it all works out. You know, well, the good thing is our two aldermen uh, can now uh, have a really good working relationship where they can uh, figure out how to make it work for both for both worlds. Hey, we're going to get in the car and you're going to show me around Chatham. Absolutely, and welcome to Chatham. Worley, we just walked around the corner from the Mather Center and uh, we're looking at one of these great Chatham blocks down here. Right there, this is a this is one of our this is a, a classic Chatham block uh, with the larger lots. Uh, typically, lots on, in this particular section are typically like 180 uh, by uh, by 50. So you got a lot, a lot larger than the average city lot. Uh, and uh, you have a mix of houses. You have your, we have some of our two units here. We also have some of our Georgians. Uh, most most people know Chatham as a uh, bungalow uh, uh, ward, but in the uh, community. But it's, we have a different mix of houses, depending on which section of the area of uh, the community you're in. And one of the things that makes the houses feel bigger and the streets more open are these great parkways. Oh yeah, the parkways, and uh, people would love to take care of their parkways. Uh, people take ownership in their parkway. Uh, and uh, they work, typically we have a lot of, one thing we have uh, that works well for us is our network of block clubs. So most of our blocks, we have block clubs that are working and the block clubs get together and do cleaning greens on a you know semi anywhere from semi-annual basis to a monthly basis on some of them uh, to keep the parkways clean and in some blocks we have uh, some of our retired citizens they uh, get out and they take the uh, they take it upon themselves to clean the parkways because uh, that's how much pride they have in this community uh, and the block clubs are still active because they go back uh, 30 40 years a lot yeah block clubs are still active uh, the alderman gets office gets numerous requests to still block club parties and they are real block club parties where people come out and the neighbors come out and still talk to each other and put on different type of events uh, for the community and then, you know and you know of course they're primarily for the kids to come out and play uh, but yeah they still do them. They're not facing the kind of problems that originally got them formed down here you don't pretty much don't have the same kind of crime that you had 40 years ago when these blocks started. Uh, no, we, we, but I mean, we're not going to you know, stay, stand here and say we don't have crime, I and mean, we do have we have our share of crime. Uh, but the block clubs help keep the crime down because they keep because they network and talk to each other. It's beautiful here. Oh yeah, this is a great uh, tree line block, and uh, if you, you go through Chatham, this is one of the highlights. It's a tree line blocks that really tra draw people to our community. Now, I haven't looked at housing prices uh, lately, but the last time I looked, uh, you could buy one of these bungalows in Chatham for less than half what you'd pay in a similar neighborhood on the north side. Right, yeah, we're great, uh, we, we have a great, we have a great affordable uh, housing in this community. Uh, if you compare our, our properties, uh, the similar property to the property on the north side, yeah, you'll probably pay about half of what it is. Slowly but surely, uh, the secret is getting out that uh, Chatham is a great uh, value for, for, for housing. You're closer to the lake than a lot of the northwest side. You've got the great Cole Park down here. You've got uh, better schools in some of the northwest side neighborhoods. Right, yeah, we, we're, we're all proud of that. And we know we, 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 we like what we have, but we feel we can continue to keep doing better. Uh, and so we have a lot of people who are just getting involved recommitting themselves to getting involved in this community and uh, bringing us back to the level of excellence we've had before. Let's get in the car and go around.